Hello all. So another misty, foggy day outside. We'll do most of the video inside today. So what we're going to talk about is what's happening here in the U.S and other parts of the country where the world was getting away from coal, burning coal for electricity. But we've reversed that and now we're starting to start up coal again, which is the dirtiest fossil fuel there is. Time for the board. The coal that we're talking about is being used to make electricity with. These are called coal fire power plants. Obama was getting rid of them. The orange man is bringing them back faster and more vigorous than ever before and re reducing the regulations on them so they can pollute as they need to or want to. So lately coal workers have been getting really sick with blood cancer and other illnesses, black lung and other things that coal miners often get. The reason they get so sick is because coal and coal ash have toxic chemicals in them like arsenic, selenium and mercury. There are over 1,300 coal ash dumps in the U.S. at present. 67 coal ash dumps in 22 states are leaking toxic chemicals like arsenic, selenium, and mercury, both on land and in our water supplies. That's in, that's in 22 states. If you have a coal ash dump in your state here in the U.S., I would not get in any public water or fish or eat any of the wild animals around the area. The only reason the U.S. or the orange man himself decided to go with fossil fuels such as coal and tar sands, he doesn't care about the health of the people in the U.S. The only thing he cares about is that kickback money he gets from the coal companies and the oil companies. You know, there is so much natural gas being thrown away right now. They flare it, they throw it up in the air, and they light it on fire wherever there's a processing plant for coal and oil, you will find flaring. They flare off the gases that they could use to make electricity, which are so much better for the environment than using coal and, and tar sands oil. What are we thinking about? Dollar signs, huh? That's it. Well, when you get blood-borne cancers and illnesses, you'll know why. Because our country is becoming very toxic now. Lots of toxics that going into the water, food supply, and on the land. And you know, nobody seems to really care too much about all that, considering how many coal ash dump breaches there's been here in the U.S. But I definitely do appreciate all the comments about this, and all the comments on the last video. I definitely like the new subscribers, even though YouTube is taking away a lot of our subscribers because they say they're fake. Oh well, <laughs> YouTube, you're so broken. Are you going to get the comment section working so I can take part in commenting with my commenters? Just ask. Until next time.